Hey everyone, it's me again, Silly Ninja, and welcome to another episode of me playing Scribblenauts and being creative and uh, foofy in uh, all kinds of ways. And I'd like to start off this episode by thanking everyone, subscribers, and just people who are watching my videos who, uh, who are not subscribed to my channel, because just this morning I found out that I have reached the arbitrary milestone of 50 subscribers. Now that doesn't seem like a huge deal, but believe me, it is for me. Uh, for the effort that I put into the channel and the work that goes into it, 50 is a huge number for me, and I would like to thank everyone who contributed that to that uh, in some way or the other. Let's go for a hundred, and to do that, I say let's jump right in to knotting all the scribbles because, as you know, the uh, popular folklore folk proverb uh, says the man who uh, uh, in the morning scribbles the most knots is worth uh, two stones in a bird. And that's a real proverb, I assure you. Last time we did the Saint Asterisk. Risk? Saint Asterisk? See, my mind goes, no, that's wrong. That should be Saint Asterix. But Asterix is the little Roman fellow from the uh, from the uh, the comic books. I don't know if you know him. If you don't, I don't blame you. I'm old. So, yeah. Hyphen Heights. Two complete stars and ten shards. I say we dive right in. Green arrow, beam me up, Scotty. Pew! I don't know what that was. That was my beamy up, Scotty Soundy. Welcome to Hyphen Heights. Uh, there's a bistro over there and a red barn and a mean looking kid. Look at that. Blue Star, old man, uh, pizza guy. No, not a pizza guy. That's a baseball guy. I get my pizza and my baseball is uh, all screwed up. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. Uh, let's start with. There we go. Let's see. Oh, there's a lot of people who need help here. Let's go and look over there. So, uh, this whole place needs help. I don't know what this is about, but. Yeah, if I build a house like that, with bricks on the side and then just brown in the middle, I would need help as well. There's a red barn. There's a kid over there. And blue star. Uh, I say we just do it from left to right. Or right to left. I don't know. Uh, what's going on there? I couldn't see that very well, but uh, okay. Let's just... Uh, oh, yeah, help her. Let's see what she has. Help me befriend the birds. Help you befriend the birds. Okay. Um, what do birds like to eat? Uh, birds like to eat seeds and cookies, and uh, this is an, this is an old. Let's see. It. Oh, oh, I know. We could uh, add her an adjective and give her. She she would be good friends with a bird if she could fly. So let's make it a flying grandma. There we go. Now fly, fly. The birds are coming down, and there's a. Is that a rooster? I believe that's a rooster. It's technically a bird, but you don't see him flying very often. Uh, uh, okay, I'm just gonna leave now. Have fun with your birds. Um, okay. I'm sorry, that was uh, <laughs> the first thing of this recording episode, and it's something like that. Uh, this game, this game. You! You look like you need help. Will you help get our ball? Be careful not to touch the old man's lawn. Of course I can, of course. Uh, I'll get your ball. Yo, what? I need that ball. Give me that ball. Steal. Yoink. No. Steal. Yoink. He's not gonna let it go, is he? So... We, oh! He's a quick one. Um... Now, I could make Maxwell fly here, give him wings, and just go in from the air, but I'd much rather... if this old guy was blind. There we go, he's... N uh, we, we've put some shades on him. He's not gonna see it now, so we can... Yeah, there we go. Up, 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 up. There's your ball. Uh, give. Uh -huh. There you go. And that's another shard for us. And uh, I'm. Uh, I should be proud of myself. I've made up an old dude blind. <sighs> Me. That's the blue star. We're gonna leave that for last. I believe there's two in this level. Uh, yeah, there's one over there. But this whole house needs help. Let's go there. The grass is overgrown. Oh no! What you need, my dear, dear house, is, um. Let's see, professional gardener. Uh, gardener, uh, derp a derp. My brain is derp a derp today. And go. And go. Mm-hmm. Go, 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 go. Dude, you have, like, a spade. It's not even a spade, it's a mini spade. And you have a flower on your, and a mustache, and a hat. You're actually pretty awesome. Uh, but that's not gonna do it for me. I think this calls for a... Nope, not that. Um... 
yeah, we're gonna do that anyway. Chainsaw, because that seems to uh, get rid of all of our problems. Attack! Meow! That was one. Careful not to attack the gardener. Meow! There we go. Oh, there's two there. And meow! It's actually colossal grass. Uh, not for long, because out of the darkness comes Maxwell with a uh, meow! Hmm. Chainsaw, and there we go. Lovely lawn. I think I'm gonna hang on to this chainsaw because uh Nyo! Oh Nyo! Oh it's oh it's not okay. I was, thought I could kill the flowers that, but apparently not. Flowers are immortal in this world. Uh I should have known that. I should have known that. The blonde kid, you. I need to get to school, I'm afraid Juice will hurt me. Dude Deuce Deuce? He's okay. Point one. He's called Deuce. You could easily exploit that, okay? I mean, you could flush him, and that would be funny, because his name is Deuce. Second, he's tiny. Look at him. Ah, uh, I, I could just attack him with the chainsaw. <sighs> I'm not going to do that. I'm not a... Uh, I know that in the last episode, a baby committed suicide, but that was out of my control. Okay, maybe I spawned the baby, but it, it decided to... to No, don't... No, oh, no, 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 no. Don't pick up the chainsaw. Don't... Uh, <laughs> Um, he... Oh my god, I was just dropping that to get rid of it, but... Uh, and he's my brother? What? You can now play... What is happening? I apparently did a good job by dropping a chainsaw uh, uh, just in front of a bullying victim, and he picked it up and went bananas on Deuce, our friend Deuce. Our shitty friend Deuce. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, okay. Go to... Oh, check on Lily. Oh, I think we have enough star right. Uh, we want to complete this level. Continue. Okay, we're just gonna put this in our backpack and keep it safe and uh, away from Deuce and his uh, his friend over there. Oh man, this is the most chaotic episode ever already, and we're only at four shards. Oh, uh, there's a pizza guy. I told you there was a pizza guy in this level. Uh, this pizza will be cold by the time I deliver it on foot. I know. Uh, that's what happens to me all the time, so what you need is a portable microwave. A portable microwave for you. There we go. You dropped your pizza. You dropped your microwave, and you run like the wind. Okay, fresh delivery. But it got us a star, so that's alright. Uh, let's go and... Oh, there's nothing over here anymore. Oh, we can go up there. Hold on. Can we go up there? Yeah! There we go. Look at that. Who needs help? You need help, old lady with the... I don't actually know what that's called. Do you know what that's called? Uh, tell me in the comments. Uh, but she's using her Jedi mind powers to float a banana and a hot dog and a hamburger here. I've tried that. Believe me, I've tried that for years now. Uh, it's not working. Try my new magical movie treats. And she wants me to start with them. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, okay, let's start with the healthy alternative. I'm gonna consume the floating magical banana. There we go. Ow, I turn into a banana. What? Well, okay. Huh. Oh, I guess we're gonna finish this level as a banana now. You never know what happens. You never know what happens. You wake up in Scribble Knot Land. Scribble Knot, yes. Yeah, scribble Tibera. And you wake up and suddenly you're a banana. It just, you know, it happens. You have to deal with shit. Uh, or deuce. And that, that guy's. <laughs> that is gonna stay funny. Um. I wish someone would give me something romantic, like in the movies. What do they give someone in the movies? I know. I once saw a movie where a guy gave a girl a huge, not a hue, a hue, pink round elephant. And that was very romantic. That is huge indeed. I'm playing this on a 23 inch monitor and it's taking up more space than the monitor. Well, it's not, but it looks like it's taking up more space than the monitor. Uh, there you go. Have... Oh, it's in 3D! <laughs> I guess everything is in 3D these days. There we go, that's Kurt J. Mack. Uh, I recognize him because of the glasses. You may notice him as well. Go to his channel and uh, like him, favorite videos. He's having an awesome time there. Uh, how far are we ahead? We have three shards to go and then two complete stars. Uh, jump on the... Oh, I thought we were going to jump on the roof here, but we're not. We're not. Now, I believe there was something we could enter over here. Yeah, there we go. And the underline. No, I don't want to go to the underline. I, I want to go to the upper line. I'm gonna go up here. <sighs> Things have to be so hard. No. Uh, okay, time to get myself up there in style. 
Get myself a golden helicopter. Spawn that in. Yeah, and go up there. And dismount. That that's how I roll. That's how Max Hole rolls. I'm wearing a banana suit with a little red hat, uh, red hat underneath it, and we're spawning golden choppers just to get one level up. That's how we do that. Help me become a better basketball player, dude. What you need is oh no, I could make you a very a, a very talented coach, or I could make you taller. But I think uh, no, I think I'm going to give you some stilts. There we go. You don't want him. You don't want him? Why don't you want to have these uh, beautiful stilts? Just take these stilts, please. Please, could you take the stilts? Drop them on your hand. Oh! Oh, I'm sorry! I'm sorry! No, wait, 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 wait! Wait! What? Oh, did you just float? How did he do that? Dude! Help me become a better basketball player. Okay, alright! Don't... I'll make you tall. Okay, there we go. You're now tall. Oh, somebody's stealing the helicopter! What's happening? There's... Who is stealing my helicopter? And we gotta find another way to get up there. Um... Oh, this is it. This is it. I've been... I've been dreaming of this moment for years now. Uh... It's time for the huge chocolate... Eagle! Hey, buddy, welcome back. I need you more than ever now. Uh, somebody's uh, stealing with my uh, somebody's stealing my helicopter. He's uh, he's running off with it. I know I'm wearing a banana suit. Don't look at me like that. You've just been fed. Uh, right. There we go. If you could just bring me up there. Holy macaroni, dude. Have you been eating? You've been getting weight? You're slow. Oh, what's happening? Yeah, don't fly into the rotors, man. That's This is actually pretty dangerous. Is that... That is a deuce. Uh, dismount. There we go. Yeah, okay, yeah. You go and teach him a lesson. Here, take this, uh... Take this... Oh, I thought I could throw it, but I can't. Take this! Uh, it's dangerous to go alone. No? Nobody got that reference? That's okay. I'm old. Uh, doggy. And... A guy. I need to teach this dog a trick. Of course you need to teach this dog a trick. And what you need for trick... As any magician will uh, will vow for, is a good wand. So there we go. Take this wand and teach your dog a trick. Okay, uh, dude. I know I'm dressed as a banana, but I meant a magic trick, not just throw the wand and have it. You know what? Uh, this game, it's I. Uh, okay, we have nine out of ten shards. Uh, we still have one shard to go. I can't seem to find it. Okay, let's get a, not, a, not another helicopter, but let's make a, a golden biplane. There we go. That's, uh, that's the, uh, the sound a biplane makes. It's going to start at vision. Ooh. I can't attack it. Okay, I thought I was gonna I'm gonna be able to shoot it. But I'm not. I'm not gonna be able to shoot it. There's our eagle. Watch out for the eagle. We're looking for the final uh, shard here. I don't know if we can find it. And come in for landing. Oh, catastrophic. Catastrophic. Oh, man. Okay, I better, uh, I better get off this thing because this is actually quite dangerous. Now, I believe this guy, yeah, he has a blue star. Help the boyfriend on his big date. I would be happy. Uh, even though I am dressed as a banana, it's gonna be a little, uh, little obvious that I'm helping him. Oh, we're Cupid now. Okay, so we're not a banana, we're now Cupid. We have wings, and I saw a little bow. Yeah, we have a ping bow. The boyfriend is going on a special date with his girlfriend. Help him make things run smoothly. Begin by helping him look presentable, of course. Because what you need, my dear, is an Armani suit. And, of course, it doesn't know Armani, or I'm just spelling it wrong. I don't know. I don't have the money for an Armani suit. I just know how to pronounce it. Uh, let's just get him a... Um, oh, a bow tie. That will work. Here, wear this. It's dangerous to go alone. I'm not making that joke again. I'm sorry. Here. T dude. Dude. 
There you go. No, don't give him the bow and arrow. Just, uh, okay, listen, you know what? You're gonna use give what? No, use no pat. Uh, add adjective. You're gonna be uh, elegant then. There we go. Oh, you look fabulous. There we go. Hair, it's hair drying and perfume and... Dude, what did they do to you? You don't look much better. He is looking pretty good. I guess he is. Okay, I would wear a suit on a date. Uh, I lie. I've never worn a suit on a date. Um, but he's looking pretty good. The boyfriend can't show up without a ride. What should he pick her up in? Hmm, what should be the best thing to pick up your first date in? I don't know. Let's go for a moving van. Not a moving van. A moving fan. My excuse is uh, is that it's very hot outside and my brain is uh, slowly melting. Uh, there we go. Moving fan. Go and move some love. Hmm. Oh, he hasn't got any flowers. She will love this vehicle. All right. However, he cannot show up empty-handed. Give him something to help start the date off right. Hmm. What starts off a date? Let's see. What can we think of? We, we could give him... Uh, we could simply give him a ring, but I think that's a little too easy. I don't really want to give him a ring. Uh, I think we could go for the pink elephant again. Uh, but this girl looks like... Uh, no, this this girl doesn't look like a girl who would enjoy a pink elephant. I think we're going to go for a friendly shark. There we go. This is a friendly shark. Uh, it's Wiggly. It's Wiggly. It's Wiggly. Look at that. I'm not doing this. It's, <laughs> it's wiggling on itself. Go. Go and uh, no, okay. Uh, dismount that. Um, okay, there's no shark there. Don't worry, I'll put it in my backpack. Do we have anything in the backpack? Um, we have a drum set. We have a chainsaw. No. Uh, okay, here. Uh, go and give her this spyglass. Stop kicking your moving fan. It's not working. Ah, no, that's not working as well. I don't. Uh, I'm not good with girls, um, for this exact reason. Oh, what, what girls? Oh, girls, girls, all girls like a, a, a bouquet. Yeah, oh, look at that. That's great. Uh -huh. Go. Yeah, that's exactly what she needed. See, she's all in love now, and he's, uh, <laughs> she, she's right into the moving van and drives off and leaves him there, and he has to run uh, behind the van. I'm gonna go and eat spaghetti. All right, the day seems to be going smoothly, I say. Now help set the mood. Create something to make the dinner more romantic. What I, I... I know what makes the dinner more romantic is a fat Italian singer. That always works. Uh... Oh... Uh, all right. A fat itching singer. Hmm. <laughs> An iambic singer. Yeah, that would work. There we go. Whoa, uh, oh, whoa, where'd you guys come from? What is that? Don't tell me. I don't want to know. Okay, and they're going off into a dark tunnel. That is a very good first date. What's happening? Oh, they're seeing a movie. I'm sorry. This is a movie. This is a, a black and white movie. They went on a date to the 60s. There we go. Did the 60s have... Uh, Black and white movies? I don't know. I wasn't there in the 60s. I'm not that old. I don't know what you're thinking. But it seems to work. Uh, she said yes to proposal. What do they need at the wedding? Well, first they need a bit of f***ing sense. You don't marry people on your first date. Come on. <sighs> what do they need on their first wedding? I, I better get up there. I really need to stop these people. Uh, uh, okay. Um, what would stop me from getting married? I think a Frankenstein thicker would stop. No, that's not gonna work, is it? No, 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 no. A monster thicker would stop me from. Uh, not a, a moist thicker. Yeah, a moist thicker would definitely stop me from getting married. There we go. He is very moist. He is sweating like a thicker, I guess. I don't know. Uh, I wouldn't call this date a success, but they would. They're getting married, and I have my, uh, my star ride. So there we go. That's one out of two complete star right, that we can get here. Which brings the total up to 13. We're going to hit continue because...
as I can remember, there is another character with a blue star. There we go. What is your problem? What can I help you with, ma'am? Help improve the neighborhood. I'm always up for that. I'm a big banana. Out with the old. There we go. What needs to happen? Oh, I'm wearing a yellow hard hat. Everything is yellow. There we go. Okay, it's very stinky. It's time to improve this neighborhood. Start by bringing down this old building. Oh, I've always wanted to do this. I always wanted to use one of these. A wrecking ball. Yes. And we only get the wrecking ball. I, w I meant the whole machine and the thing and the... <sighs> This'll do. This'll do. We're just gonna... click -o! Uh... Uh, oh, bam. I'm sorry, dude, but we really need to, uh... Oh! I, oh, I dropped it on my own head. It's a good thing I'm wearing that hard hat, though. But I don't think that this is working. Uh, we're just gonna put this in here, because the second thing that I've always wanted to do is blow up a building, so I think we're just gonna rig this thing with TNT. So, what they do in the movies... Oh! Oh, I didn't mean for that to happen, but it worked, and she's very happy. Is she wearing shorts? She's a businesswoman with shorts, just because she can. A new structure needs to occupy the empty lot. Create a place that the citizens would enjoy. I can most certainly do that. A uh, new structure that the citizens would enjoy. Who wouldn't enjoy... Hmm... I... S okay, uh, let me think here for a second. Um... Let's go for a grand musical apartment. Uh, apartment, I'm sorry. Yes, it's it has a saxophone on it. Is that a saxophone or a trombone? I can never tell. There we go. And it's musical as well. I did a great job there. They're gonna enjoy that, aren't they? Aren't they? Hello? Are they gonna enjoy that? What? What would the public enjoy? I don't know, what would the public enjoy? Just tell me. This is all I could come up with. Please tell me. <sighs> I guess we're gonna have to wait for the uh, the hints to come up in nine seconds. In nine seconds, uh, I'm gonna have a, a much better idea of what the public would enjoy. This game. Sometimes, there we go, new hint is available. They would like a place to see movies. Well, that's very specific, isn't it? You didn't tell me that. I already built this grand thing. Okay, let's put it in a backpack. Uh, who knows uh, what we could use it for. They want someone to see movies, so um, let's make them a grand. I like the word grand. Uh, grand... Cinematic... Building, because just writing cinema is too easy for me. A grand cinematic building. There we go. Oh! Oh, that doesn't seem very structurally sound. It's hopping around. It's hopping about. And now, oh, it's fallen over. It's fallen over. It is opening day. Spread the word that the new building is ready to use. Um. Um. Uh. Um. Uh. um, uh, people? Uh, hipsters of the world, um, your building is, is fine, your building is fine, it just, uh, hmm. decided to hop away. Khaleesi, what are you doing here? I thought you couldn't use, okay, never mind. Huh. Okay, let me just give you these, uh, these flyers. Uh, okay, one... Flyer paper, just uh, I keep forgetting that scribble knots does, scribble knots doesn't do well with the plural of things. Here, have this flyer. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, I can't run. What's happening? Uh, that is the scariest thing ever. I would run like a bear who needs to pee if I saw something like that. Oh, that's terrifying me. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna pick up this star and everything will be all right. She's winking at me. Uh, it's a little, um, a little odd, but it brings up the total star adds to 14. So we're gonna press continue here. And now, against my better judgment, uh, well, against my better judgment is not something you can say uh, when wearing a banana suit because nobody's gonna believe you have better judgment. But. Is there actually? No. I can't seem to find the last 
shard, so I think we're just gonna leave it, uh, leave it here. Yeah, I think one one little shard is not gonna get in our way of freeing uh, Lily at the farm. Ah, <sighs> I think we're gonna go there next episode. Let's see what we have to do. So we just completed this one. Well, not completely, but uh, almost completely. So the next one, uh, how long has this video been running for? Ooh, almost 26 minutes. I think the next episode we're gonna go ahead, uh, we're gonna start off uh, visiting Lily at the farm, and then we're gonna go do uh, Full Stop Diner, which is another big map. Are, are the rest of the maps this big? 1-8? Yeah, kinda. These are gonna, all gonna be a long video. If they stay this big, if they're all gonna go uh, over the 20 minute mark, I might just split them up in two, but we're gonna have to see that in the next couple of episodes. So for now, I'm gonna thank you for watching, share this video with a friend, and get the channel up to 100! Is that too much to ask at this point? I don't know, I've only just reached 50, but I'm happy for that. Thank you again, you guys, you are awesome. Uh, don't forget to like this video, it really helps my videos get out there. And subscribe if you've liked, or you've, uh, you've laughed a bit, I know I did. Uh, so, I guess I'll see you guys at the next video. For now, have a very good day, everyone.